9th of June, 1865, Charles Dickens had it all. Fame and fortune as the nation's most beloved novelist and a seemingly perfect family life. But an event was about to befall the man who wrote such iconic titles as Oliver Twist, David Copperfield and A Christmas Carol that could have brought all this crashing down quite literally. The summer of 1865 saw Dickens returning from France via the Folkestone to London boat train when a faulty railway line and misreading of engineering timetables caused the locomotive to derail from an unrepaired track. This resulted in 10 fatalities and a further 49 injuries in what became known as the Staplehurst disaster. Dickens was a great showman who always loved to be centre stage, and this train crash was no exception. He took charge of the situation, selflessly tending to the casualties. The famous author then returned to his carriage to ensure the safety of two prized possessions, the manuscript for his latest novel, Our Mutual Friend, and his mistress. Dickens had been travelling back from France with Ellen Turnham, his mistress, and her mother. The revelation that the well-known family man was having an affair would have created a huge scandal. Dickens used all the power at his disposal to avoid appearing at the inquest into the Staplehurst crash in order to maintain his reputation. Following the accident, Charles Dickens went on to finish Our Mutual Friend along with short ghost story The Signalman, which took inspiration from the events of the Staplehurst rail crash. However, in 1870, on the fifth anniversary of the disaster, Dickens passed away after suffering a stroke.